What's going on everybody? It is Middlebro back with uh, day 43 of the new era playthrough. Picking fresh off of uh, Horde Night. We are we are hot and heavy after that. <laughs> was a pretty successful Horde Night. You know, got there is a little bit of damage, but nothing too and nothing too catastrophic uh, from the from the horde. We got a ton of loot though. Let's take a look at it. Uh, so, got some 762s. I sprained my leg once again. Seems like a perpetual thing. Tier 5 chainsaw. Drone armor play mod schematic. Bit of blue and 44 magnums. And we got Crusade Bando. Furious Fist books. Art of Mining Volume 6. Hey, we actually finished out the mining books. Perfect! And we'll actually start reading some books. We actually got two Wasteland Treasures Volume Threes, which is the Acid Book. And we'll take that. And we got more, you know, more rifle books, which we've unlocked Sniper Rifle Quality Four. No, no, we might hit Tier Six wonderbar. by the end of this. Yes, wonderbar. Those of you who might not know, wonderbar, which Stove said. Uh, or tier 5 chainsaw. But uh it means uh wonderful in in German. Uh, so fun little fun bit for you. Um uh, we got some extra <laughs> We got steel tools quality four. Okay, nice. Um but let's throw some loot and throw some stuff in there just so I can continue looting. Automatic trigger mod schematic, we got a tier three nail gun. We got another level up for. We got four level ups overnight from the Horde Knight. We got five skill points total to spend. Medic mod for the drone, and. I think that's it for there. And. Alright. We still got a couple loot bags up here. Is that a. That's just a piece of trash. I'm like, is that a loot bag down there? Got more wasteland treasures and all that. We got knife guy. Round it all up. Let's just see. Unlocked hubcap landmines. Read you. Read you. A lot of this we don't need. Oh, I didn't even notice a tier five steel axe. I I was considering maybe making some steel tools after we unlock tier four, but. Well, that I mean, that'll save on a that'll save on a steel axe. Look a little bit wary. And in case you did tune in for last episode, our job is actually where our horde base is at. So what we're gonna do is actually, in case you don't like a, if you have a similar situation, you can just do this. Like click on your quest, you know, make sure it brings it up, you know, like the one you want, and then just remove quest. Yeah, it feels the job, but it, I would rather... I've already put in so much work into this base. I would rather not lose it. Now. Next order of business. I was wanting to check really quick to see how our turrets did in terms of ammunition. How'd you do? So, unlock the ammo. You only did a... You only spent about 100 rounds on you. This one... This one spent a lot of ammo. Maybe it was shooting over at the zombies uh, on the staircase there. Shotgun tur- Wow, that thing really went through some- The shotgun cleaned me out of my ammo, so... I think I have plenty more for that. It's not really a big deal for me to take care of them, so... Yeah, not, not that bad of damage. I'm not- not too dis- not really mad by it. And... We can cure our ailments here really quick. I just want to clean up this stuff here. I think- I'm th kind of thinking, like, looking at this damage, I'm like... I'm looking at it like, well, what could I do for... for this? Yeah, this got damage, but... I think what would be in mandatory order would be a 
would be like over the next week before we end it off like yo have it, help it hold out would be a, a nice concrete pad uh, I think this is most of it cleaned up though for the like just the overall debris this really isn't that bad especially compared to the previous horde night I this is literally just kind of chump change of damage it's like yeah I have to tear this out like we'll repair this up a little bit but not bad so let me get myself fed and and you know cured up uh, and I will meet you over at Terry Hughes and we'll see what kind of tier 4 infestations we got all right everybody so coming back to Hughes here land on the gyrocopter uh, we'll just there we go jump down a little bit that would be handy yes and in case you're wondering what stove is saying about like uh, what would be handy I was making a suggestion I'm like I'm like what would be a good idea to me as a as a box we're open from dusk until would dawn. be to keep staring and you'll be staring uh, down a gun barrel what I was gonna say though is like uh if we had a search function in the in the old uh, in the storage boxes because like it would be nice just for a handy little a search function I'm looking at books now we have not a lot of stuff there's not even that much or than like an automatic mod. I knew a pacifist once and... <laughs> now that he's dead I guess he wasn't all that bad looking at tier 5 stuff infested clear um, you seem like you could use some dukes we'll do the I hope to one at savage soon. country and uh, don't get yourself killed you never know if we get this uh, if we get this done fairly quick uh, we might even take a trip over to uh, to Bob's because uh, one thing I was talking about with stove over overnight like well like while preparing for the horde yesterday is like I haven't found any vehicle mod schematics and aside from off-road headlights and it'd be nice to have some of those this shouldn't be too bad of a, a flight here with the gyrocopter though but yeah, like, I was saying, like, you know, like, I would like to have at least a supercharger mod. Hang on. There we go. Um, you know, like, the fuel reserve mod, like, in my casual world, I've managed to find all those mods, like, and then it, I will say they're really handy for little bits of, uh, exploration. What is that? Oh wait, I think I recognize that POI a little bit. We're dropping, we're dropping. This is like a wedding venue I've seen on PC. It, well, this is a really cool POI. Like, uh, um, we're also coming up to a service treasure map. Really should just keep on throttle. Yeah, we're already at our little job here for for Hugh. I'm hoping this doesn't take that long. But, uh, and if you're familiar with, like, uh, old Navis game, like, uh, from, uh, the Legacy version, I think this is, uh, where the, uh, where the working sifts used to exist, uh. Oh! Bonus loot. Hello, good sir. And, you know what? Just for a little bit of just to get this out of the way, I want to get the... There we go. I just want to get that car out of the way. A couple of rifle books. Anything fun and exciting? For 87 out of 100 for rifles. So, what is the next tier needing? We need five more books for rifles. There's a bunny over there. Tier 4 infestation. Somebody's already breaking out of the, breaking through the windows. 
The loot will be significantly worse here in the in the uh, what I was gonna say is it'll be significantly worse here in the in the Pine Forest, but it really isn't that big of a big of a deal. I don't mind coming. It's a nice little change of scenery for once in a while. Come here. Ow. Make sure we just take care of that crawler. Ooh, you even dropped me some loot. Two more rifle books. Hey, look, steel shovel. I was wondering where. I was like wondering where the other one I found the other day was looking, but. I was gonna say is like for Savage Country. If you're, from, if you really want legendary parts, I'm not gonna search them because I have plenty of legendaries. But legendary parts, but uh, you can actually uh, if you loot all the clothing racks, like uh, there's a good there's a good chance of finding uh, finding uh, legendary parts. Hello, crawler. Oh. Where's the uh, big boy at? You look like you need a 762. Boom. Hey, if you want to take the time, like, take, go through and lose these. Like, I lose, like, the Super Savage Country. And, uh, found some, found a couple legendary parts over there. That was in the winter. But you never know, you might find some. Uh, cops still want to spit. Looks like he's crashing in from the roof. Come here. Since he insists. There. Um, make sure we just check through here. For all the zombies. Yeah, I got I got a lot of birds sitting, so it's like... Hide, with, we'll hide in the bathroom. With Big Mama here. Oh, okay, that was short -lived. Big tubs. And... Come here. I ain't letting you escape because uh, you're part of my quest. There. I'll just search that ammo case up. Rifle parts. Oh boy. We got company. And... There's another airdrop rolling in. Ooh. Oh, it looks like somebody wants to whom play hero. Here, catch that. All right. Uh, yep, that was a very that was a very quick little clear. So, let's do that, and we'll check check the loot. Give me one second while I lock back this. All right, just broke it into. Ooh, right that site. And got some basically got my lockpicks back out of that. Uh we'll just scrap you and you. Take you. And we gotta break into Savage Country. Let's see how the sack says. Sweet, you can finally one shot blocks. Well one shot the uh, storage blocks. And take that key out. And we'll search you up. You have a sharp six book. We'll just search, grab you, grab you. And might as well just see if we get a bonus out of it. Also, let's check this iron shovel quick. So it's doing... Oh yeah, big upgrade. I think if I... If I'm looking at it correctly, we might even be able to one-shot dirt, like, dirt blocks that aren't surface. So, we're... That's all, that's basically all the loot. One more. Iron Spear Quality 5. I don't care that I didn't pull out the nerd armor for it. Because I'm not expecting to it. Which I completely forgot about our skill points. Um, what do we want? Mmm. Kinda wondering if I should just go go balls the wall into 
perception for rifles. I think actually what would be a better investment would be into Meyer 69er. Meyer 69er get some extra block damage, like for because I do want to grab that. I do want to grab that uh, buried treasure. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to we'll run over and I'll run over and dig that up and I'll meet you. Yeah, and I'll show you the uh, loot out of that. So, just one moment and we'll catch up to it. Well, everybody, so I found the treasure. I just wanted to show you, just like, how, just take a look at how small this treasure circle is. This, you know, I basically dug around here, like, you know, took the steel shovel to it, and I'm happy to say that I'm able to one-shot blocks with Meyer 69 or level 3. So that's really good stuff. I'm able to do that effectively. And... Here I'm showing kind of why I don't like lock picks a little bit, yo, know, because you can break so many, and I don't have any points invested into lock picking, because I'm just kind of like they can be kind of unreliable. So I've wasted seven, lock eight lock picks, and there we go. Usually, like once it gets blue in second, then it'll stop playing around. I did collect the airdrop, so. We got medical journal and vehicle adventures, which we've capped out. We need to read these. Sniper rifle quality five. Awesome. Treasure maps are pretty good. Oh look, it's a it's a wild Mikey. Hang on, let me try to. Oh great, I was worried I might have to pull out the uh, do the old uh, Austin Powers uh, journey, but. Nah. Thankfully, we're not completely stuck. So yeah, thankfully that hasn't been that hasn't taken too long out of our out of the uh, out of the journey. So and so, I think we got plenty of time to do uh, Jack and Sally's getaway. Hmm. I'd say you know, like uh, we're good to go to Trader Bob's. Like we could turn that quest of Trader Hugh really quick with the uh, the motorcycles. So. Oh, the gyrocopter, so let me you know, let me just kind of fly over and to Trader Bob's and I'll and we'll, and we'll see if he's got anything uh, fun for me. All right, everybody. Well, that was a bad that was a bad little little landing. I did not realize the car was there. We could just if the gyrocopter would please. I don't think it's my, it's not me steering, it's, it's, but, uh, I think the car was causing issues, but, Richard Bob's, let's see what he has. Bob, what you got for me, buddy? Hmm? Doggone it, I can't find my impact. I got vehicles so slick. If you had a 4x4 four four frame, killers. I would be considering that, huh, right about now. Slower bank, not really. Tickle in my fancy. And you have suppressor, you don't have from Oh boy. I have the drone mod. Oh look, it's the most useless vehicle mod schematic that I had that that could be for single player. Oh, brother. Bob, I expect better out of you, buddy. Ah. Uh, I'll take a look at his food. I'll buy your champ chowder. Well, holy shit. I knew you were gonna buy something. Yeah, yeah. Here. Have 40 bucks. Mm, 440 I bucks I just took out of the ATM. Tell your friends about me. Trader Bob. And you know what? Since I like you, Trader Bob, we'll do a. Are you looking for work? I've no, got not shut up. Worthless as teats on a bull. Mm -hmm. 
I've got a little coin if you got the elbow. Town grease. Square Apartments, nah. Well, here's yeller is mustard without a bite. I'll do I the. I think I've got a few jobs. Yeah, let's do Atlas Metal Company. If it gets too nasty, get Sounds the hell fun. out of there. It's better to live and fight another day than die for a few. Goops. I figure we'll do an extra tier four, like uh, for old Bob. Honestly, I would say like uh, if you if you had to ask me like which which of my trader which of the traders I like the most of of our current selection, it's Bob and it's Bob and Jen. Like uh, Bob's Bob's really nice, so and uh, you know Jen's Jen. She's you know she's really nice and she's not you know she's just not an outright ass like uh like trigger you and trigger wreck basically i would regulate like, you know trigger gen trigger bob and then uh um trigger joel and then trigger wrecked it would also be a tie for me between uh bob and jen if bob actually sold the uh parts like he has sold more vehicle stuff like he is supposed to be the vehicle guy Looks like we're going in for a wasteland raid. Oh, this ought to be fun. Oh boy. So. Yeah, that's my big problem with Trevor Bob. It's like, he just doesn't stock enough. It's like, he doesn't stock enough for like, tra like vehicle stuff. And it's like, you would think he would have the, uh, the vehicle mods. Like the vehicle mods from uh, two, because he is the vehicle guy. But no, he doesn't. That's so kind of like, sorry, Bobby boy, but yo, know, got to knock you down a notch. Like, even then, it would still be like I would still have Fair Jen as my my favorite. Would be close. Okay, here we are at our tier four infestation in the wasteland. Um, let's prep a little bit here. Oh, the local zombies are hanging out. There we go, take care of him. And, uh, I was wanting to grab a repair kit for the SMGs, just so we have a little bit of extra stuff. So, take the, take the Tier 4 infestation. Looks like there's... Yeah, there's a ton of vultures circling, so... Hang on. Might as well just shoot him down really quick. Might as well take him out for some free XP. Oh, hello! Make sure we don't go outside the bounds of our POI. Oh boy, I'm infected already. Oh, you actually drive me some loot. Thank you. Oh, well, the legendary part. Get you out, and... Big Mama. Oh, thanks, you've... You've angered the local population. Ah, <sighs> thanks, Big Mama. You're the best. Give you a little bit. There we go. And even more local zombies. Take care of you. Mikey seems like he would be the type to uh, kind of hang out in a junkyard. Not surprised by him being here. And just want to search these up just to see what they got. You never know. Our bow hunters and lovely. All right, puppy. Hi. Thank you for saying hi to me. Ooh, two tools I just. I had nothing fun out of them, but this can get a little crazy. So. Quiet. And give you a hug. 
There we go. And, well, while I'm here, might as well run her uh, one round, go Dutch. I love Mother Load for uh, increasing the harvest you get out of the, the little stuff, so. And. Let's load the M60 up a little bit. Oh, how I wish I had an explosive for this. But. Ooh, took, took some legs off. Whoopsie. Anybody fun here? No? I shot the porta potty. That's the biggest war crime here I've done. Um, the sniper rifle hasn't gotten its bullet in. Oh, birdie! There, get out of here. This, this pier, this POI I found is not that bad to do on infestation, but. Watch me eat my words. Um, give me a... Give me a bandage really quick while I... Just so I have a little bit extra healing here. Their tools digest for... And... There is going to be a lot of zombies here. Yep, there is going to be a lot. Would everyone please... We want to make sure we take care of everybody here. And... Take care of you. Take care of you. And job done. So okay, we only got an in-game hour before before Bob closes up. So I'm gonna I'm gonna speed run my way over to him to Bob's quick and and see if we can make it over there. Catch you in just a moment. Coming in for a flyby over Trader Bob's. Probably gonna buzz the tower quick. And Whoop. <laughs> I figured we'll just jump out quick. Bob, 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 Bob. Well, it's a hot one today. Come on in. Cool off and have a look around. I'll take the beaker of the dynamite. No, the. We're closing soon. Thank you. Make your final purchase or blow your popsicle stand. <laughs> okay, we, we're out. Oh, I just wanted to run a quick glade that reward. I'm like, because I don't plan on coming up to Bob's uh, sometime soon. Did take a little bit on, take a little bit of a hit on the gyrocopter, but really, the cooler. The cooler? Anyways. Yo, know, I figured like do a quick little job. I'm like I'm like I don't know if we can turn it in, but we're speed running. <laughs> oh now back to Atlas Metal Co. I'll meet you once the loot's picked in too. Alrighty, we picked into the main chest, see what we got. We got our tools digest, and we got our various things. And we'll just break into this, this stuff. Medical supplies, nothing in there. And... We'll just read that, that. Someone's getting mad at me through the door. Yeah, whatever they can get, they can get mad at me all they want. They're just mad that I'm stealing their loot. And 
weapons bag, what you got. Various parts. More stuff. And just drop some of this. Various, not uh, various other miscellaneous and infestation cash. We got you. Have a drink of you. We can just drop that, that, that. And drop you. That's pretty much all the loot out of that. And grab that all up. We're not done yet, though, because I actually did see... Hang on, let me take care of you. Like, put a lid on it. Thank you. I did see a zombie bear here. I wanted to see if we can take him out really quick for some extra loot. And let me just spray him down with the M60. Because those are basically guaranteed red loot bags. We also got extra little kind of sneaky I didn't know about with Atlas Metal Company. Just one second while I throw this up into the into the jar copter. Yes, I made a ladder. And I wanted to just kind of check this out, so another kind of tier five stun baton. Lovely. What's some explosive stuff? Thank you. And we'll check what's in the old uh, zombie bear. A couple of miscellaneous books, some low tier, lower tier lumberjack stuff, and that's about it. So yeah, good little, good little looting session here, folks. So I'm going to leave this episode here. Uh, if you enjoyed the episode and you want to see more from me, please uh, subscribe and leave a like, and also. Uh, you know, leave a comment if, uh, with your thoughts uh, below, and also turn on notifications. Helps the channel out oh so much. Have a good one, and take care.